Greetings everyone, my name is Wei Jianyu. Today we are presenting our paper, Robust Link Prediction over Noisy hyper anomaly Graph via Actor Learning. hyper anomaly Graph where facts are represented with a base tree blade associated with an option number of key-value pairs are introduced to better describe the complex facts in real-world scenario. As examples like that, uh, in addition to the primary triplet, able incorporated industry software industry, two key value pairs in the scope of computer program and in the scope of operating system are introduced to better describe the detailed field Apple incorporated concentration on in the field of software industry. To make use of such, uh, such a structural knowledge, link prediction tasks have been widely adopted to solve knowledge graph completion and reasoning problem. However, modern knowledge graph in every content noise. Due to the large scale of modern knowledge graph, existing knowledge graphs are either constructed with automatic extraction approach, which suffer from noisy web corpora and perfect extraction techniques, as well as built by crowdsourcing such, which is sensitive to malicious participants. Such noise could be very harmful to the downstream task applications such as link prediction. And due to the large scale of the modern knowledge graph, memo correction against this noise is effort confuming and always restricted by the limited human resources. Again, in this background, uh, to address the topic of robust link prediction over noisy hyper knowledge graph while further utilizing the limited labeling budget from human annotator, we introduce active core learning technique into robust learning over hyper knowledge graph and uh, propose our NILA model. Our main contribution can be concluded as follows. Firstly, we introduce element-wise confidence beyond traditional fact-wise confidence and bridge the gap between them with the least confident principle. Following the least confident principle, we propose a noise-resistant hyper link prediction technique via active core learning, which is, to the best of our knowledge, the first work to address this issue. Uh, so, here is the structure of Nalen. Before the introduction of the uh, main structure of Nalen, I would like to uh, have a brief introduction over the Alman-wise confidence and the least confident principle. Uh, for the Alman-wise confidence, precisely, for each element that is another relation, we adopt a confidence score for each of the elements to evaluate the probability of the element to be true. As shown in this example, for the primary relation, we adopt the conf confidence value of, of 0.9, uh, uh, meaning that the primary relation is of 90% probability to be true. To, to further connect the element wise confidence and traditional fact wise confidence, we introduce least confidence principle. That is, the confidence of the fact is determined by the least confident element in all elements in this hyper fact. fact. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Uh, as shown in the example, you know that uh, in this hyper fact, the confidence of this fact is determined by its tail entity with uh, a least confidence score of 0.1. So this is the general structure of our NALA model. Uh, following this confidence principle, NALA integrates three components as shown in the figure. That is, a hyper link predictor, a cross screen convolutor, and an effort efficient actor leveler. The hyper link predictor conducts link prediction over hyper knowledge graph. To address the robust link prediction issue with noisy hyper knowledge graph, we use predictive fact wise confidence generated by the cross screen convolutor to guide the training process of the hyper link predictor. To effectively train the cross screen convolutor with the limited human level data, we designed the iFold Efficient Actor Library to acquire the human leveled hyper fact with a two step leveling strategy for the training of the confident evaluator, followed with label ratio compliant data augmentation procedure. Here is the first part of our NIL model, hyper link predictor. 
in the hyperenaline predictor, a replaceable hyperrenal fat encoder is adopted for the encoding of the musky training fat. With this encoding, a probability over the uh, entity or relation is generated to determine the musky element and evaluate, the, uh, evaluate with the cross entry loss. Notably, notably, Okay, thank you. Notably, we rescale the training loss according to the predicted fact-wise confidence of the training fact to weaken the importance of the least uh, less confident fact. That is, the final training loss is the sum of the link prediction loss of all single fact multiplied by its fact-wise confidence. The, this is uh, the second part of our NILA model, cross-grain configurator. Firstly, we adopt a shared encoder with a hyperrenal link predictor for the cross-grain configurator. On one hand, the encoder generates informative embedding by learning the compact correlation between entities and relations in a hyperrenal file, which could then be used to effectively support different downstream tasks, including link prediction and confidence assessment. Since both of these two kinds of tasks uh, require to address the information in the correlation and compatibility between the elements in the hyperrenal fact. On the other hand, as a small size of noise level, hyperrenal fact is often insufficient to train a high quality encoder for the confident prediction task. The shared hyperrenal fact encoder could benefit from the large training set for the link prediction task. Then we utilize learning layer to generate element-wise confidence followed with main polling layer for the fact-wise confidence according to the least confident principle. Both of the fact-wise confidence and the element-wise confidence will be utilized to guide the effort-efficient active labeling procedure. Here is the last part of our model, effort-efficient active labeler. In the effort-efficient active labeler, we did an effort-efficient labeling mechanism with both fact and element-wise confidence, which can be more informative but partly label the fact. More specifically, we firstly select fact to be labeled with uncertain sampling. That is, select fact with confidence closest to 0.5. Then, we use element-wise confidence of each query fact to get the quantitator to check the element of the fact according to the ascending order of the element-wise confidence and terminate the labeling process until one incorrect element is found. This strategy is also consistent with the least confident principle. That is, if we found a negative element in a hyperrenal fact, we can claim that this fact is incorrect, since the fact-wise confidence is at most equal to the element-wise confidence, according to least confident principle. To address the lack of training facts for cross-grain convivialator in low battery situation, we introduced level ratio complement data augmentation for low battery situation to generate pursued level fact while keeping the ratio of positive facts. We generate the pursued level positive fact by positive level the closest fact to the human level positive fact in the embedding space and generate the pursued level negative fact by negative sampling for <laughs> the pro for the pursuit the level positive fact, followed with level ratio complement drop-offs to ensure the positive negative ratio of pursuit level po uh, po fact consistent with the human level facts. Here is the experimental setting of our Nilan. We evaluate our Nilan over GF 17,000 wiki people and W50,000. The statistic of this hyper knowledge graph are shown on the right. For generating the training factor in the for the noise factor with extend traditional next sampling strategy by crafting at most half of the elements in a hypernode fact to fit the hypernality. We are double node level from 2% to 100% compared to the amount of positive fact in our training set and leveling budget from 0.025% to 0.25% uh, compared to all the elements in our fat area epoch. 
Here is the experimental result uh, over 100% of noise level and 0.25% uh, of leveling budget. Uh, it's clear that Nathan consistently outperform all the baselines in the link prediction task and uh, as well as the error uh, detection task in this table. We also say that the Nathan achieved the best robustness against different node level compared to all the best performed baselines in all three types. Our last week on the ablation study, uh, we designed Nilan no SE, Nilan no US, and Nilan no EL to evaluate the necessity of the shared encoder, answering assembly, and the effort efficient act leveling. In the Nilan no US, we adopt a shared uh, separate encoder for the link predictor and the content evaluator. In the no US, we replaced the answering sampling part in the effort efficient act leveler with random sampling. In the Nilano ER, we abandon the effort efficient act leveling mechanism by, uh, by remove the, uh, by remo by remove the early stop stage in the FO efficient actor labeling, that is, we need to label every element in a hypernode fat curated by the answer sampling. Uh, here is the experiment result shown on the right and uh, showing the necessity of this three kind of strategy. We also evaluate the statistical significance of this ablation study and the parity test and the p-value for the Nilano US is less than 0 0.01 and 0 0.05 for Nilano US and Nilano ER respectively. At last, we reach the conclusion. We firstly introduce element wise confidence beyond traditional five wise confidence and use least confidence principle to bridge the gap between them. We probe Nalen to address a robust link prediction over noisy hypernodally graph, which is to the best of our knowledge, first order to address this issue. At last, we conduct extended experiment over Nalen on the sidewalls baselines, showing the superiority and robustness of our Nalen model. That's for our presentation. The code and the paper are available for the QR code. Thanks for listening.